All right, as we take a look at what's going on right now, we're looking at the cloud cover that's around. So we look like it was going to rain all day today. We're seeing some peaks of sunshine helping us out as far as our temperatures are concerned, but we're still seeing a lot of cloud cover in place off towards the north and west, still seeing some severe weather, especially now over west sides of Oklahoma. There are tornado warnings for Beckham and Greer counties until about 7 o'clock with these supercell storms that develop near the dry line and are continuing to push the way to the east. So the dry line is starting to shift its way to the east just a bit more. We're going to be dry through the remainder of the evening until probably about midnight, 1 o'clock, when the storms push in. So, overnight tonight, that's when the rain and storms approach. Marginal risk of severe storms in the forecast overnight through the Metroplex. Our West Counties has a slight risk of severe storms for the potential of maybe this line of storms with 60 to 70 mile per hour wind gusts within some of them and quarter sized hail. So, the future sky forecast shows maybe a couple of spotty showers about 9 to 10 o'clock in our far West Counties. And then going closer towards midnight to 1 o'clock, our rain chances really go up. Here's that line of storms that I'm talking about. Gets closer towards the Metroplex by about 2 to 3 in the morning. Our West County is possibly dealing with some of those very strong winds. And then going to about 3 to 4 or 5 o'clock. This forecast model kind of overdoing it just a bit. I think it will start to weaken just a bit more. And as we go into probably the 7 to 9 o'clock hour tomorrow morning, making its way to the east and still in our southeast counties by 10 to near 1, still some more rain and storms holding together. We're now back up to 84 at DFW, which was our high that we had just before noon today. That sunshine's allowed us to warm back up to 84. We're sitting at 84 in Fort Worth to 81 in Keller and 80 in McKinney. And across North Texas, same story. Upper 70s to the low to the mid 80s holding together. If you're headed to Globe Life Park there at Arlington for the Rangers game tonight, you have the sunshine peaking out at least right now. So that's warmed you up just a bit. We're going to be seeing temperatures dropping through the 80s to the 70s the next few hours, but remaining dry. South winds will still be at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Then late tonight, some showers will be popping up closer towards mid night and then we talked about tomorrow morning some leftover rain around but then we dry out 92 will be our high with mostly sunny skies in the forecast uh, for tomorrow now we're going to be seeing more rain back in the forecast thursday and friday some afternoon showers and strong to possibly severe storms and then this weekend some heavy rains going to be possible maybe some widespread rain on saturday i'm thinking that could be flooding our main concern as we have a front pushing its way through from 88 friday we cool our way on down into the upper 70s by sunday and by monday drying out in 82 degrees